What is going on, everybody? This is Stridox here, bringing you a competitive class setup video. I was uh, asked to do this by somebody in the stream, and I said I would do it. So now we are here. Now we are making this video. So let's go ahead and get into the video, guys. I'm gonna what I'm gonna do in this video. I'm gonna show you all my class, and then uh, then I'm gonna go into an actual game mode and show you how the guns are used and whatnot, things like that. And we're gonna play the 50 kills against bots. Uh, but yeah, so let's go ahead and get to the uh, the class setup video. Um, so as of right now, let's just say we're playing S and D. Okay, we're, obviously we're about to play some free for all. But if we're playing S and D. These are the classes I would be using: the the HX or the uh, the HC XD, uh, like the car. It blows up. You drive it. Lightning strike and hellstorm. Okay. Specialist I'm using is uh is overdrive, which I always use overdrive. They ban a bunch of stuff, you know, like vision pulls. Uh, you know, I don't know. There's a bunch of stuff they like hive and all that other good stuff. They they ban a bunch of stuff. And now into the classes, guys. Let's go ahead and start off with the first. Uh, AR that I highly suggest using uh, mainly because the recoil on it is like zero okay when you shoot it it's just like the, it's kind of like the ACR in Modern Warfare 3 in my opinion if you ever played it but this is the ICR guys it's an assault rifle I have the ELO optic sights on it um, I have quick draw grip and stock now remember guys I said we're, I we're playing S and D so I have death silence fast hands and af afterburner now if we we're doing like hard point uplink things like that obviously I would change the dead silence I would move it over to uh, blast depressor because uh, no mini map signature when thrust jumping. Obviously, when you jump, it's going to show up on the radar if you don't have blast suppressor up. Um, and I've literally been struggling whether if I should have this and take stock off and then put dead silence and blast suppressor on because it, it's such a difficult decision, guys. And like I honestly want to do that. Let me just see. Well, then again, because then I would take take something else off. So, yeah, it's it's rough, man. I, like. Here lately in um, S and D, I haven't been using Dead Silence, and it's crazy. But you know what? I've been doing okay. So, uh, anyways, so I'm just gonna have Dead Silence on for now. Uh, so that's my ICR guys, and all my perks are gonna be exactly the same. Okay, so all, all my classes, except for obviously, what is this one? What, what do I have on this flat jacket? Uh, I was running a hard point. Okay, that's what that was. So I was running a hard point for that. Um, anyways, so this is my AC, my ICR class, uh, which is a assault rifle. Here's my submachine gun, the Vesper. Uh, and again, these are all guns that I recommend using. Uh, you got quick draw, grip, and stock, and then obviously you have afterburner, fast hands, and dead silence with one stun. Um, then you have an M8 with a three-round burst gun um, with your ELO sight, quick draw, grip, and stock. Always mainly these are the main attachments. Uh, then you have your sniper, the SVG 100, which the ballistic CPU and secondary ICR with uh, grip and the same perks as well. And then last is the Shiva, which I'll, which the Elo, quick draw, grip, and stock as well, same perks with the stun. Which y'all see me use all these guns and uh, whatnot in this video. So let's get into this, and I can show y'all what it's all about, man. Mhm. Mm Oh gosh. Drinking some coffee. Let's go. Alright. I'm ready to play some competitive game play after this video on the stream, guys. It's gonna be gonna be nice, gonna be real nice. So I'm uh, gonna use an overdrive, which you can run faster with. So it took about four minutes to just go over the classes, which is like kind of long. So this might be a long video. Just stay tuned. This is my first game on today. Haven't even shot. First, we're just going to go down the list, guys. We'll play for like, we're going to 50, so I'll just do 10 kills apiece. We'll, and uh, get, let y'all see what these guns are all about. And again, I still need to get my shot warmed up because I'm not even warmed up. You know, I should have put radar on. What the heck was this? Dude, it literally spawned. Remember, guys, this is like the this is like the uh, the ACR in MW3. Remember, this is the assault rifle. God, there's so many bots though. So. Oh, 
with that. Alright, that's the ICR. I'm gonna go ahead and die. And switch over to the Vesper, which is a submachine gun. This one you want to mainly run and gun with. It's a very, very fast machine gun. Oh crap. Very, very fast. It's almost like using a rapid fire, almost. I, I love using this gun at hardpoint, man. This is the this is the gun that I highly suggest using. Whoa, what a nade, bro! This is the gun I highly suggest using for like hardpoint. It's going to be a sub player. Home dude had a uh, rejack on. So much commotion going on. The only thing you gotta watch out for this gun, guys, is the recoil on it. There is some recoil when you shoot, because it, it, it tends to want to go up whenever you shoot shoot uh, this gun, the submachine gun on the Vesper. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and die. Alright, so that was the Vesper, now we're gonna move over to the other AR, which is the M8. Three round burst. Watch. See you shoot. I'm holding. The, you can't even hold. You can't hold the trigger. You gotta actually uh, trigger finger it. Which this is a very, very powerful gun. Dude, this dude is eating, bro. Holy crap! All these smoke grenades. Very, very powerful AR gun. Very easily to. Um, if you want to play patient, you can literally just pick people across the map. There's a little bit of recoil when you shoot long distance. And if you're up close with this gun, it really sucks just because if they have an ASM1, they can literally do. Not ASM1, wow, I'm talking about AW now. If we had a uh, Vesper, they can uh, just outgun you pretty easily. So, Alright, so that was 10 kills with that. Let me go ahead and die. Run around and kill me, homie. Dude, kill me! Alright. Now I'm gonna use a sniper. Let me show you what this one's about. I haven't used a sniper all that much, but if I had to use a sniper, this is the one I would be using with uh, the reticles I have on right now. Which is like a. It's, uh, Oh crap. Dude, my aim with this sniper is horrendous. But it's pretty much a one shot kill. So if you're a sniper looking for a sniper rifle to use, this is definitely one that I suggest. Ugh. Crap. And this is more of a patient gun, guys. Like I was saying, like you use this one to like just kind of camp and like watch alleyways and stuff with. So right now, I'm just kind of running and gunning, and trying to make the plays out here, you know. But be advised, hostile UAV incoming. Very, very powerful gun, guys. Alright, I need three more kills. What the hell? Alright, there we go. 40 on that one. Go ahead and switch over to the Shiva. Now, guys, this is a very, 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 very powerful AR. It is a one bullet, one shot, no, not one shot, but you only shoot one bullet at a time. Look how powerful it is. Watch, one, two bullets, okay? So you, all you do is just tap it, tap the trigger. And, you just, and it just picks people. One, two bullets, just like that. One shot in the head, I'm pretty sure. Let me see if I can get a headshot. See if I can get a headshot and I can show y'all. Yeah, 
Headshot, dang it! I'm trying too hard to get a headshot right now, but y'all get the point of this gun. It is very, very, very powerful. And if you want to, if you want to be more of a patient player and just sit back and pick people, this is definitely a gun to use for sure. Just depending on y'all's uh, your play style, you know. I'm trying to go for headshots now. Okay, now I'm, I'm gonna try to get some kills. See what I'm saying though? Just if you play patient, guys, this gun is definitely for you. It's almost like a sniper. There's, there's a headshot. It's literally almost like a sniper rifle. You just sit there and just poke and shoot. So that's pretty much it guys, that's pretty much the guns that I would highly suggest using in my personal opinion, just that's going by my, my gameplay and what I've used so far. Um, it's a very, very, like that's the Shiva here man, it's a very strong AR and if you want to sit there and pick people off and uh, just kill them, it might be ban banned in the future, I'm not sure, but um, it's a very good gun to use, but yeah. Camp. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the classes I use for the competitive gameplay, guys. So if it helped out the video, which I hope it did, please leave a like. And um, and yeah, thank y'all so much for watching, guys. I hope this helped out, helped y'all's gameplay out a little bit, and and kind of give you a better idea of what guns to use. So that is gonna do it for today's video. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all did, please leave a thumbs up. Whenever you leave a like, guys, it really helps the video out and helps my videos get out there uh comment if you want if you have any suggestions and uh subscribe if you haven't done that already but i uh, hope you all enjoyed the video till next time this is stridox here peace